Let's learn how to retrieve, display and update a single record in this video. Add Firebase Core and Fire Store dependencies in pubspec.yaml. Import these two packages. Initialize Firebase in void main. Create a stateful widget. The tutorial on how to display data has been done earlier so let's do it again. And create page like this. Data will be displayed in this column. We are using Stream Builder for that. Using this client collection. Add a Stream Builder inside this column. Use this stream for retrieve client data. Then create a builder. Check snapshot has data. Retrieve and display data using for in loop. Create a new Dart file for updating data. Update client. Input material Dart. Create a stateful widget. Name update client. Add a constructor that pass with client ID from the main display page. Return scaffold and add a title. Open main.dart and import update client dart. Add a edit icon button below the mobile field. There is a navigation in on click. Navigate to edit page and pass client ID. We can retrieve data using this ID. Then run the application. Click edit button. Update page is opened. Open update client file. Create a stream builder for retrieve and display single record for update. Import Cloud Firestore. Add a stream. Using client collection. Doc is client ID. That ID is passed from previous display page. Then create a builder. Check the snapshot has data. Then retrieve name email mobile fields. Print these values for checking. Return a padding. We will display our data in inside this return block. Then run the app. Edit. Values printed. Remove this print functions. Create a flutter file for update form widget. Update form. Import material dart. Import cloud fire store. Creates stifle widget. Name update form. Add a constructor and pass variables name email, mobile, and client ID. Then create three text editing controller for name email mobile text edit fields. Then add init state. Initialize past values in text editing controllers. Name controller dot text equals widget dot name.
then email and mobile controllers. Returns a column. Add three form text fields. Then add controllers. Name controller. Email controller. Mobile controller. Open update client file. And include newly created widget. Import update form. Padding, child. Update form. Name. Pass the name value. Then email and mobile. Then add client ID for updating. Widget.client ID. Then run the app. Edit. Records displayed. Then we add elevated button for update data. Open update form. Add elevated button. Child. Text widget. Update client. Then add an update code in on pressed function. Create a collection. Client collection. Then collection.doc. Doc is our client ID. Dot update. Pass all name, email, mobile fields. Value is in controllers. Use navigate.pop for return after updating. Run the app. Edit. Change values. Update. Data is changed. Thank you for watching.